Good evening everyone. I am Prasan Batra, a 9th grader studying at Vasan Valley School. So I am here today to talk about how technology can be climate change's tool to sustainability. I feel that my generation is and is going to be the most affected by climate change. Gen Z is the generation which is going to see the fastest emergence of new technology. Our generation can definitely and most surely make the most of upcoming technology and try to live sustainably while reversing the ill effects of climate change. I feel that the issue of climate change is also going unnoticed by many and that isn't good for us at all as we don't realize this at the moment but in the near future climate change will impact all our lives in a negative, negative and a terrible way. Even though, uh, even though our generation is very conscious about sustainability, the older generations such as millennials who are actually the drivers of businesses and of creating products and services are still not aware about the harm of climate change uh, and many, many people from the older generation say that nothing such as climate change exists and this is all uh, imaginary and unrealistic. Uh, but I, I truly believe in climate change as our generation is going through climate change and I personally have experienced climate change uh, and yeah, being a Delhiite, I've lived in Delhi my whole life and I've noticed that every year uh, winters arrive around Diwali which is around mid-October to uh, early November but every year this time has been stretching and stretching and stretching but this year only till a few days back uh, it was pretty warm actually compared to the previous years and Honestly, I've only started, recently started feeling a bit chilly and I just felt that the uh, winter season has only just kicked in. And it's already mid-December by the way. And uh, all this is due to the ill effects of climate change and it's a big, big global issue all of us are facing today. Looking at the positive side though, as I stated before using technology, the damage done already by climate, uh, climate change is definitely reversible and thankfully we are uh, witnessing that change taking place. We all know that pollution impacts climate change big time and petrol and diesel vehicles are the biggest contributors to pollution. But, thank, uh, but thankfully the idea of electric vehicles is pretty widespread and mainstream now. And um, everyone is uh, moving towards uh, having all kinds of um, vehicles uh, electric. In fact, only yesterday while I was coming back from school I saw an electric auto for the very first time. And I've also seen electrical buses many times and on numerous occasions I've seen many, many uh, electrical vehicles. Our generation must ensure that we accelerate the space of adoption of electric vehicles to build a better and more sustainable society for ourselves. Coming to my second point, I believe that uh, as the technology has evolved, uh, newer tools have been added to make our lives comfortable. Um, such, but our energy consumption has also been increasing due to the new products and tools that have come into the market over the course of the past few years and because of the pace of uh, all this mass production um, we've, we just, we've just been producing and producing and producing energy uh, but not, just in, not in a sustainable uh, manner at all as to meet, the, to meet the demands of all these products companies have uh, as I said just been mass producing energy in not a sustainable way at all so we need to make sure we produce sufficient amount of energy but in a sustainable way uh, which uh, can uh, which can enhance our sustain which can enhance our way of living sustainably in a huge manner and our generation must and um, I'm, I'm sure it will embrace solar energy wind energy hydropower and all uh, other forms of green energy and uh, for our power needs Okay, so use of digital technology is also very is also a very important factor uh, as and uh, the reduction of paper uh, the, the reduction of paper usage will also affect the planet in a big way uh, as we won't have to cut trees anymore and we'll keep the green cover intact on our planet and we really need to focus on that right now because uh, trees are being are being cut down uh, and that's not good for our society and for the environment at all. Another thing we need to realize is that technology is not just about creating new gadgets and gizmos, it's also really about finding new ways of doing things. Um, for instance, there are businesses and entrepreneurs who've been using technology to create, uh, to, um, to create uh, new business models that are more sustainable and less resource based. There are also activists who are using technology to raise awareness 
uh, about this issue climate change and mobilize others to take action this is especially important in a world where so many of us are connected through the internet and social media i really hope that in the future we must be engaged in creating a smarter uh, and more sustainable society we should create sustainable buildings along with uh, uh, we should create sustainable buildings that, uh, along with using technology to become more sustainable we must also make uh, technology itself more sustainable uh, when we and once we reach this point where technology itself it's sustainable um, that's definitely going to help us uh, build a better society and maintain a highly sustainable society and when uh, technology is itself sustainable we will be living on a beautiful clean and green and ever sustained planet and that is definitely the goal for our generation and the many generations to come and uh, many people uh, perceive technology as just the cause of climate change but it's also a tool to combat it as technology can have is we haven't explored a lot of factors of technology yet but it is just such a big spectrum that there's so much left to explore and we can do so much more with technology and just not um, use it to harm the environment thank you that's all i have to say for today